Hey, how's it going? This is Minister Gold. This is a mix it up video on how to do the initial setup for mix it up. Um, I stream on Twitch and I use mix it up every day. And I stream a uh, variety. I'm playing Blasphemous 2 at the moment. And the reason why I make this video is because um, in the past I've had a lot of chatters actually like get annoyed that I don't show them how to set up mix it up. And so I'm going to make this video. Um, it's been a while since so I've made mix it up videos. And yeah, I'll try to make them once a day. I can't promise anything right now. I'll at least make them once a week. But I'll try to make them once a day. Okay. So, the current step that I'm at, we're going to assume you've already logged in. You've already signed in to mix it up with your Twitch account. You've already connected with your Twitch account. I don't mean your boss. I just mean your personal Twitch account, and that's it. Okay? And then, for the moment, I'm going to go to Services. Uh, OBS Studio. Assuming that's what you're using. If you're using another uh, streaming software, I'm afraid I can't help you with that. I don't use XSplit or Streamlabs, but I assume the steps would be similar. Okay? So OBS Studio... When you first connect, and actually mine is disconnected, which is perfect, um, you're going to have to go to uh, OBS, go to Tools, go to the WebSocket server settings, and you want to make sure that the WebSocket is enabled. Okay. And then you want to show... I Actually, I can't show you this. Uh, let me move this aside. Basically, you want to show connect info. It's going to give you the password. I am going to do this on another screen because I don't want you to see my password. So give me one second. Okay. So when I click on, and I can't show you, but when I click on show connect info uh, below the server password, it opens a new window. Uh, in that window, there are three fields, server IP, server port, and server password. So you want to copy the server password which I just did. I'm going over here. I'm hitting paste and then connect. Oh, because I have to hit apply after I enable the WebSocket. Okay, so it's not going to take my password right now because I, I, I clicked on enable WebSocket server, but I did not hit apply. So I'm going to hit apply. Okay. I'll try connecting again. Okay, so now we're connected. Uh, test connection. And there you go, it's connected. So make that the first thing you do. Enable WebSocket server, get your get your server password, and put it in here, and then connect. Okay. Next we're gonna do is we need to add a browser source to OBS. This is not my main uh, scene, but pretend it is. Um, I'm going to delete this just for demonstration purposes. This is my mix it up overlay. Okay, I'm going to add a browser source, and we'll just call it test MIU, test mix it up. Okay, uh, we're going to go okay. I'm going to right click, transform, fit to screen, uh, to make it fill the whole screen. I'm going to do one more thing. I'm going to go 1920 by 1080. Yeah, because I wanted to fill the screen like that. Uh, let me go like this. You can't see me. Now you can. Okay. So we'll go back to Mix It Up. You can't see that, can you? So we're going to hide this source for now, just so you can see Mix It Up for, on my side. Okay. Next, as far as the URL or the overlay, you're going to click on this gear in the top right corner below the close button. You can click on overlays over here on the left side. And then all of these are extra ones that I made. You can put a name here, click add to add a new overlay. But this is the one that it comes with initially is a default overlay. I'll copy that. I'm going to go back to OBS. I'm going to double click on test MIU. I'm going to paste, I'm going to select all, then paste that overlay 
URL in here. Okay. Now it looks like it's gone. Okay. But I have a test command. It's a it's a command that just um plays a video, basically. If you can play videos and images through your overlay, that's how you know that your overlay is working. Okay. So let me play a command right now. Okay, you heard it, but you didn't see it. You didn't see it because they didn't unhide it. It's right now it says not visible. So we'll make it visible. And let's run that command again. Oh, it's already pro it's trying to process it right now. Okay. So play that command again. My name is okay, so there you go. Now, uh, something you'll have to do, uh, this is something I found I have to do, and if somebody has a better idea on how to handle this, let me know. But I found whenever I start a stream the next day, I have to refresh my browser source. I have to refresh my mix it up sources. Otherwise, uh, they don't show. And to do that, click on the mix it up source, click on refresh, and test it out. Make sure it shows what it's supposed to, like whatever your test command is going to be. And if it shows, then great, you're good to go. If it doesn't show, I would say double check your connection back inside uh, services. And yeah, that is how you set up a mix it up overlay in uh, OBS. And that is a quick rundown of how to set up the mix it up overlay. Hope it was helpful for you. Uh, if it was, please uh, like the video, please subscribe, and if you'd like to hang out with me, I'm on Twitch. And playing Variety, currently Blastmas 2. And yeah, thank you for watching. Adios.